Me I drink pine and ginger. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Shana Panapu. Welcome to day three of Vlogmas. Can you guys believe it's Friday? Like this week went by so fast. I don't know if it's just me, but it's a pretty fast week, like three days. I think December started like yesterday, no? Anyhow, let's talk about my event. I went to at Rockefeller Center in the city, did Christmas tree lighting. It was pretty good. It was chilly. I met some amazing people. Everyone was nice and all that jazz was, you know, um, an eventful weekend. It was cold as hell. After the event, I we went to have dinner, right? And it took forever for us to find a restaurant because it's not everyone had have the vaccine so you know in the city if you don't have the vaccine you cannot dine we went like so many different restaurants trying to persuade the person at the door to let us in and nobody come for me that have the vaccine okay to each his own let's just say every state is different because in the city you have to have the vaccine to dine in jersey here you don't have to in long island you don't have to so each his own so we did went somewhere else we left new york we went somewhere else and we did you know have dinner because everyone was starving um i went home i got home like after 2 a.m had to wake up back at 6 work all that just so it's been a very tough morning because at one point my eyes was burning the coffee was just not working all that jazz but one of the pro of being a medical coder you can work from home so i love my career i love it i love it that i can literally work from home because so it's a blessing that i can you know work from home and my job is pretty okay from once you not everyone had the privilege because some people, one of my associates at work, they take away her privilege from her because she used to, um, like, clock in and not working, per se, like, clock in and the work that should be done is not being done. So, obviously, you're home, but you're not working. So, I always try my best to get the work done. So, because I want to keep this privilege as long as possible. If I could keep this pri privilege until the end of winter, <gasps> that would be a blessing because I'm not trying to go outside in the snow, cleaning off my car. The, the cold time is not nice. It's not pretty at all. It's not. So, but anyway, it's um, lunchtime. I think I am going to stop working for today and start using my OT because we had a meeting yesterday and we were talking about OT and stuff. So I did put in a couple days along with a couple half days because I want to vlog every day for Vlogmas. My first time doing it. I am so proud of myself. Today is day three. But today I'm going to make some Jamaican soup. I am longing for some soup. I have been having a cold day all week. So I want to have some soup. I make a big part of Jamaican chicken soup. So if you want to know how I make my Jamaican soup, then just come along in the kitchen with me. But let me say from now, one thing that's in soup, in Jamaican soup, but it's not in my soup, my mom always say like, Shana, you don't have tea. Like, my mom always gets somewhat upset. Like, she cannot have soup without dumpling. I'm not a dumpling person. Dumpling does not go into my soup. So for all the dumpling persons, I sincerely apologize. Dumpling will not be in my soup, but it tastes good just the same. So let's go see how Shana make our chicken soup. It's winter time. So chicken, um, chicken soup is one of my favorite things to make in the winter time. Yeah kitchen and start cooking because it's going to be a process it's going to be a process 
it takes time to cook um, soup. My Christmas tree, I'm gonna do my own Christmas tree lighting tonight. I'm gonna light you up. I'm gonna do that. And I did, I did all their, these um, pineapple ornaments on um, Macy's. They took forever to get here. They're finally here. So I'm gonna add those to my tree. Also, wait. Shana. Yeah, so I have a couple, like those four ornaments right here to add to my tree. Let's get to the kitchen and start get cooking. Let's cook some meal. We are here. Welcome to my kitchen. I'm gonna get all the ingredients together and start cooking. Let me get all my ingredients together and come right back. Cause I'm going to need a bunch of stuff. Hope I have everything. Let's hope I don't have to go to the store. Okay, so this is all my ingredients. I am using chicken Thai. Normally, we use um, chicken foot or, or chicken back, chicken foot and chicken back boil. Really good soup, but I'm not a chicken foot person, but I do love, let me turn this light on. I do love chicken foot soup, but drink chicken back soup, but me personally, I'm not a chicken foot person, but I drink chicken foot soup if somebody would give it to me make it and give it to me yes of course when my mom or my grandma whoever made chicken foot soup if I would drink it yes chicken foot and chicken back boil really good soup but I'm not really a chicken foot person like I now nah. I drink the soup but I don't eat chicken foot I don't like chicken foot but it boils really good soup it kind of like I don't know if you understand what I'm saying like I will drink the soup but would I eat chicken foot now nah. if it's in the soup but I still drink the soup yes but yeah so no chicken foot I know don't play in yeah so chicken thai I'm washing my chicken with this um lemon I have two carrots chocho pumpkin I'm going to put a head of garlic in my chicken soup. I have my thyme, scallion, green pepper. I have two cock soup, yam, Irish potato, and of course, I love corn. I have to have corn in my soup. I have my, you know, pimento allspice, my salt, and I'm going to put a little of my all-purpose seasoning in my soup. So, I'm going to clean my meat up let's add them over here to do some washing and i love a lot of meat in my chicken soup yeah i love a lot of meat and lots of vegetable good. so that should be good i'm gonna put the remainder of this chicken here in a ziploc bag and curry it or add it to something else that I don't know. Yeah, so I'm going to clean this chicken up. I'm going to cut up my pumpkin with my carrots and my chocha. And I have my big pot right here. I'll be making my soup in this big pot. You can see the bottom of the pot is all scraped. I mean, so this part right here, this this is a pot that I use to make my seafood boil. So this pot get a lot of uses and abuses. Okay, yeah, very mock up, mock up, you know. But that's my pot. This part is not fun at all. Let me put these to the side. Later,
I'm removing the skin from my chicken. Use the skin, the soup is oily, and I'm not making any oily soup, so I will be re removing all the fat that I can remove along with the skin. I'm going to cut my pumpkin into big pieces because I will be mashing my pumpkin out once it's, it's cooked. I like the um, the flavor of the pumpkin. The pumpkin gives the soup a rich look. Also give the soup a rich pumpkin flavor. So I just cut it big because I'm going to take the fork and mash the pumpkin out once it's cooked. Adding my chicken. to finish get some work done while my soup is cooking okay my pumpkin is a pretty soft I'm squeezing it at the edge at the side of the pot right here and it's mashing so my pumpkin it is pretty soft I'm gonna have my pumpkin to the container right here and mash the pumpkin out and then add it back to the water Soup is such a process. It's a process to make delicious soup. If your soup is not a process, it's not delicious.
I'm going to peel my I'm going to peel my yam and my potato and beautiful look at the color look at this color look how beautiful my color of my soup is this is what pumpkin does work wonders in chicken soup now I'm going to add um, the yam and my potato Also, I'm going to season my pot. I'm going to wash my pimento, my scallion, my thyme, and put my cocks. I'm going to add all my other ingredients now. I will be using two cock soup. The finishing product, my soup is finished. Look at the body of my soup. All done, it's time to have my delicious chicken soup. I'm gonna make myself a plate, and this is how Shauna made her chicken soup. time my chicken soup is finished it's time to enjoy my meal relax and i will see you guys in tomorrow's video mm -hmm. this tastes really good mm. just really really good mm -hmm. see you guys tomorrow Oh my god look what the chicken soup did to me i am so beautiful shauna chicken soup uh, uh, i'm loving it thank you guys for watching remember to subscribe or like oh my god look at me the chicken soup did all this the beauty of shauna pineapple chicken soup i am loving this look oh my god i will be I will be drinking chicken soup every day.